what's up welcome back to my channel today's video is a tutorial on this eye makeup look right here it is a soft pink smoky glam so bloody perfect for a date so definitely if you like this then keep watching as always if you haven't already then please do subscribe to my channel give this video a thumbs up if you do like it hit that notification bell so that you never miss a video from me and also do follow me on Instagram this is my handle right here I do a lot of mini tutorials on there I do a lot of tips and tricks and skincare and like things that, like that on there so if you are interested in all of that then definitely do follow me on Instagram let's start taking that shade Buon Fresco from the Anastasia Beverly Hills modern renaissance palette I'm just gonna apply that on the outer corner of my eyes just kind of making a base for where we're gonna apply this shade love letter so I'm taking that and applying it on the outer corner of my eyes and uh, taking it into my crease as well just about till halfway we don't want to apply this all the way inside uh, towards the inner corner of the eyes in the crease as well uh, kind of you know just increasing the intensity of love letter I love the name of that shade it's so cool it's so pink it's perfect so just applying that uh, kind of starting to pull it out uh, next taking Venetian red I'm just going to apply that uh, intensify the coloring so basically just concentrate this on the outer corner of the eye that's it uh, not too much in the crease and not pulling that out as well then I'm just taking a fluffier brush and then bringing those colors till about midway into the eye um, like you see this is the final effect that we are going for right here taking this pigment from MAC it's like a light pink color pigment and uh, I cannot pronounce the name for uh, to save my life so I'm just gonna put that in the description box below I wet my brush with water and I'm just applying the pigment all over the inner corner of my eye and kind of going to meet it till about where we applied all of those pinky red shades just want to make sure you wet your brush a lot don't be worried about like soaking your brush because this pigment is actually I didn't like the quality of this pigment I don't know why but yeah so you just apply that and um, just blend everything in together next taking parallel now uh, we're trying to create a smoky eyeliner so I'm just going to take that with a brush and apply that in the shape of a winged eyeliner you can use that V that you have created on the outer corner of your eye as like a base to where you want to apply the wing of the eyeliner like I am doing right now. Just taking that in and smoking everything out with this brush. This brush has no other color on it. It's just a clean brush and I'm just smoking everything out like you can see. Next taking a darker brown color from uh, the same palette I'm just going to apply that on top of the brown that we applied. Next, uh, taking black, I am going to apply that very, very close to my lash line, not going over the brown at all. Like you can see, I'm applying it literally into my lash line. You can say nothing on top of that brown that we just applied. And creating the wing. Don't worry about going or extending the wing because we can clean that up very, very easily. Now I'm kind of just starting to... Um, blend everything in together the brown and the black you want to make sure you do this as much as possible uh, keep going over with black and brown until you reach your desired intensity so like I said now I'm just like cleaning up uh, that wing with um, a wet wipe and then once again going in with black and just really defining our eyeliner Once I reached my desired intensity, um, I kind of just smoked everything out again, just making sure that everything is like as intense as I want, the eyeliner is as smoked out as I want. Moving on, I used this Urban Decay Heavy Metals Eyeliner and I used it to go over that pigment because I told you I didn't like how the pigment was looking, so I decided I was going to go over with this glitter eyeliner. I very sparsely applied it all over that pigment right there and uh, this is pretty much what the upper part of the eye is and this is something really funny because this is me contemplating 
how the entire look has turned out and i did my base off camera and even after doing my base you can see it's really funny that uh, i'm still contemplating how the look has turned out but nevertheless i moved on and i'm using corrupt from urban decay and i'm just going to line my waterline just till midway of my eye i'm going to apply like kajal but just till about halfway of my eyes after that i'm taking that same brush that we smoked out the top eyeliner with and i'm just going to smoke out this as well take your time to smoke this out because we want a very soft look diffused look that's the look we're going for right there uh next uh, yeah so basically yeah that is the look both eyes done um next what i'm going to do is take this highlight from sivana colors it is also the highlight i have applied all over my face and i'm going to use that to highlight my inner corner I uh, want to highlight it very well. I'm just using a round pencil brush to highlight my inner corner. And uh, next, I'm also going to highlight my uh, brow bone under my brows right there with the same highlight. Finally, I'm using the Urban Decay Perversion Mascara and I'm applying a generous layer of mascara on my top and bottom eyelashes. Now you can stop right here but I obviously wanted to wear lashes so these really wispy ones are from House of Lashes they are the iconic light lashes as you can see they look beautiful with this look and uh, that's it we're done with the eyes finally moving on I'm just wearing the dose of colors a liquid lipstick in warm and fuzzy it's a matte lipstick and then I kind of topped it up with this iridescent pink gloss from NYX and uh, that's it guys we're done i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you in my next one bye bye